What up, family? Cause nothing to hit that like button, fam. BG. I got to say that BG release is the biggest, you know, when it comes to a hip-hop artist doing time and coming home. His rollout coming home is large. BG a major artist. He a bigger artist right now, fam, than what he was before with his cash money career and after his solo career and all, right? Now, the game have changed. Got to think about it. 11, 12 year gap. You know, it's a new generation with a new ways of gangsterism. BG is really not aware. You know, he have seen things from behind the walls, but you can tell that he not really aware of how the game is right now. You know, the clout chasing, like it, it's different. You know, ain't nobody standing on the principles and morals, you know, like the old days in the N.O., right? One thing about the game, before we get into detail, it's not about, you know, what you say when you behind the walls. I teach on this all the time. You know, the real tests come and the temptation come, fam, when you leave them gates. Hopefully, BG can stay free. Hopefully, BG can get in the swing of things and make the music and don't let the music make him again, right? Now, BG was on a call with his homie, right? Shout out to all Urban Central for the video. You can check it out yourself. But BG fam spoke on addressing the watered down hip hop game and bringing the real back, fam. He said he finna bring the real back with the tape that he finna. But he said he gonna address, you know, pretty much the lames in hip hop and bring the real back. BG finna drop a tape. Now, Pimp C did the same thing, if you can remember. Pimp C got out and he went straight on the ball, leaving on records, addressing dude's name because the game would change. In between the time that Pimp C, you know, got locked up and come back out, it was a lot of clout chasing going on then. If you can remember, Pimp C was saying, man, they stating fake dope prices. Them ain't, you know, real dope prices. This is what it is. You know, I'm from Texas, the land. BG is feeling this same type pressure um, from the hip hop game right now when it comes to bringing the real back. Now, you can't get caught up on the internet and what they saying that you should do or what you see on the internet yourself in your daily life. Comparison or trying to be um, something that you really not. I think BG should take it slow, ease in the game, fam and not address the YGs that's coming up because they're going to do what they do um, regardless. If you look at um, the hip-hop game right now, the ones that's surviving and it's dressed up like that, they, in, they interacting with the youth. You know, they still acting like they young. You look at your guys and look at your Gucci's. You know, they breaking artists. They not talking about um, and look at Boosie. They're not talking about artists and addressing, you know, how they moving and, and if they living real or not. But BG got this old school mind frame that he coming out on because the people like, hey, like you a savior, BG. BG, you a savior. We need you. Bring the real back. Bring the real back. But it ain't no weight. <laughs> it's the labels is controlling. I want y'all to understand this too. BG can... Rap all he want, and he gonna be hot. I, I respect the BG. You feel what I'm saying? But it's a machine now that the labels controlling the social media machine. You feel what I'm saying? And you can get in a space right now with gangsterism, like Boosie, and your money only be limited. I think BG so big coming out that he need to surround himself. Not just around gangsters, but, you know, baby through the cash money money machine. But he need to get around Drake. You know, he need to get on. And I'm not saying rap off on that level, but still, BG is a large artist right now. And he need to take advantage of that. You don't need to be worried about just the streets. 
no more. You know, they, they, the discreet rappers right now coming up in the game, they just getting chump chain. And then when it come to the YGs and the OGs addressing the YGs, man, they don't want to hear that shit. You know, excuse my language. They don't want to hear it. And BG went down, fam, and did his time. Everybody saluting him because he didn't have to go down by himself. By him being from New Orleans, one of the realest one, you know, on the cash money roster. All that is cool, fam. But I got to say that we in a selfish program today. It's not 10, 11 years ago. And I understand that Baby got a heart for BG. Finna bring the cash money. Them, and them tours gonna be big. But you can't do the same thing that you was doing before and expect different results. They got the hip-hop cops. They got an eye for artists like BG, Boosie, Finesse two times. <laughs> And reasons why, because the influence that they have over the streets. BG got a big influence over almost every hood in the world, fam. Cash money changed the whole dynamic of hip-hop. Because hip-hop, at first, fam, they was just talking on the gangsterism tip. You know what I'm saying? They weren't, they weren't speaking about no money, like talking about cash money. And if you look at it, in today's time, what is everybody doing? Holding up money? Talking about money, talking about their cars, talking about their change. So you you got to respect that when it comes to cash money, BG, and all of them, the way they change the weather. But B but BG gonna have to respect also the game and what it is right now. And don't get caught up in trying to correct something that's already incorrect and don't want to be corrected. Because if you look at Kodak. You look at NBA Youngboy, just using these artists, for example. You look at what's going on out there with, in Memphis situation. The YGs is not respecting the OGs because everybody that's in the YG clique is bosses. It ain't like cash money when baby was bringing them up and you, you like you had a daddy or something. Niggas ain't playing that game no more. Excuse my language, fam. To where everybody in, in, in the clique got changed. and got, Even the ones that's not rapping. In today's time. So I don't want them to. You know I want BG career to flourish. But I don't want him to get caught up fam. And what the YG's got going on. And the mistakes that they making in the hip hop game. Just because you feel that they not realer than you. And I'm saying this with experience because I used to think I was the realest one walking, fam. When everybody is individuals. Other individuals might be real in the field that I have no talent in, fam. But they the realest thing over there. Life is bigger than the streets and what's going on in the streets. <laughs> you feel me? But BG, I'm waiting to hear this tape. I don't know if he's going to be addressing some artists. I know he's going to be bringing the real rap back. You feel me? And, and that's cool. But at the same time, like I'm saying, don't get caught up in the music. Don't let the music make you. You make the music. Just like you did the time and then let the time do you. Bam, you did the time. Same in the streets. That same protocol. That's all I'm saying. But I will keep y'all updated on situations. But make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm